Pedestrians have scattered to dodge an out-of-control ute as it sped along the footpath of a busy shopping strip. Police believe the driver was on drugs at the time. He works for Metro and has been stood down pending a full investigation. The drug-affected driver careered down the footpath of Sunbury's busy shopping strip. Terrified diners scrambled out of the way. The wild ride only came to an end when he crashed into a pole. Yeah, came to a stop just down the road and um, a few guys went over and took the keys out and made sure he was alright and then just kept him in the car. When the guy, another guy took the keys out, he was still trying, looked like to me he was still trying to put his foot on the accelerator. His rampage began outside the post office just before 4 o'clock yesterday, right near the train station. He got into a metro vehicle, mounted the curb and accelerated down the footpath for 100 metres, narrowly missing pedestrians. Thank God there was no one on the street that time. It, otherwise, there would have been oh, 10 or 15 bodies on the street. Driving beside him and seeing what was happening, I, I was just on the horn just to try to people to get out of the way. Lynn McLean was about to walk out of the bank and into the path of the speeding ute. The bank employee said, Stop, it's coming through the window and she grabbed me and pulled me back. So she saved my life. I was so lucky. Metro has confirmed one of its work cars was used in the incident and the man driving was an employee, but he was off duty yesterday afternoon. He's been stood down pending an investigation. Police will charge him with reckless conduct, endangering life and drug driving. Melina Cyrus, 7 News.